new energy because we got to get these karmics up out of here so I can start manifesting for my new beginning. Sweet dreams. Masculine wants to invest in your business. Um, also, I was I was having a dream, and this masculine was trying to lowball or belittle or talk down on divine feminine. And my guy was like, "No, nah, we're not trying to hear that because you don't even know what's going on. You just talking, trying to get her in her feelings or something, like trying to make her mad at a reaction or whatever." Because they know that talking about divine feminine kids will take her there. But it's to the point where it ain't nothing going to take divine feminine there because y'all done emotionally damaged divine feminine to the point where, like. What the hell? And the only reason why they do stuff is because they know Divine Feminine not going to say nothing to stick up for herself or expose them. So nobody will know what's going on. You got to expose them so they know what's going on. I feel like if I would have made a big deal about the situation, then the masculine would have known. Blah, 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 blah. Sneaky versus honest. Cut deep. Finito. So this is just a repeat of what happened with the third party karmics when they tried to cause this masculine and divine feminine to not be together by lying on divine feminine's name. That they are now starting to receive karma. Research, good game, and since since a young didn't know it yeah so you've been taken advantage of since you were little but you didn't know it and every which way that you moved was of the light so in order for somebody to get mad is because what they did against you didn't work and on top of that you didn't let them play the victim because you had no reaction towards them which caused them to not have nothing to talk about or say oh she's so disrespectful this that and the third but what did you do why does she just pop out oh i don't know that that girl crazy it's something wrong with her i think she had a uh, or, or something like just be lying and instead of people saying hey me and your mom had a conversation about this then the third what you feel me nobody ever wants to know what you did you feel me? like i don't know it's really weird and childish but at the end of the day. Good fortune. Should trust those around you. And then it's something of I'm trying to be like you and walk like you and talk like you and all type of stuff like that and be in the good life energy and all type of stuff like that. But um, if you would have been 100% honest and uh, said how things happen, maybe certain people wouldn't be in situations. You feel me? You're conflicted about the things that you're doing, not knowing that the person that you're worshiping has done the exact same thing. So it's like, how can I punish you for something that I did? But I wish you would be more, you know, I wish I would have known that maybe I wouldn't have, you know, I would have kept my legs closed because I know what happened when you, you know. So I feel like um, you're going to be doing stuff with this masculine as a friend, just chilling, casual, whatever. Okay, cool, whatever. And then this karma is going to try to tag along. You're going to tell her, like, no, I don't really mess with you like that. I was just keeping it cordial because we was in the same environment. You're his baby mom, whatever the case may be. But as far as being your friend, that shit out the window. And I had a conversation with her. I said, I tried to be your friend, but you was looking at me funny. You was looking at me weird and all types of stuff like that and blah, blah, blah. You know, but upon getting to know Divine Feminine better, I guess this karmic has had a change of heart and wants to be friends now, just like the third party karmics. But how can you be friends with me after you've done all of this and then you play with my child? <sighs> 
People think that because I'm soft spoken or I'm not turning up, even though I've known what you did, that I'm either scary or slow or or something. But how can I defend myself when you've never approached me? You never said nothing to me about nothing. So how can I assume that you feel that way about me? You could feel that way and it could be about somebody else. And then I speak on it. It's like, oh, girl, how you know about that? I didn't. I wasn't talking about you or whatever the case may be. So it's like, I'm not the one with the issue. If you got something to say, you should say it. Like, why do you want me to press the issue so bad? And then when I say stuff out of sarcasm, they be like, that's it. That was a da 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 No, I'll show you. Something's going to happen where this connection is now going to be able to be a connection, but it's just like, yeah. And by you not giving this masculine what he wants, it requires him to use a different tactic. And if he can't respect the fact that you're trying to help him by not giving him, you know, the same thing he said, we're in a situation and you're too comfortable with this situation. So I'm going to take this away from you so you can't benefit off of it until you get your situation together. Because if I have this, that, and the third available to you, you're not going to know what it's like to not have it. Because I don't, I don't want to expose nobody's situation, but it's just like... Um, I don't know. I don't want to expose nobody's situation. But I saw a friendship. So now this masculine is realizing how much of a friend. And it's like, even though what happened happened, you're still here as a friend. And it's like, you know. So maybe this karmic is going to walk away and the reason why being that whatever, and then that's going to help him open up his eyes and it's like blah, blah, blah. Or so, I don't know what's going to happen. Find your way, find your way. 